Bell here with today's Tuesday tip on stress and attitude. Stress first because with less stress, your attitude automatically improves. Find your rhythm. Are you more productive in the mornings or in the evenings? All of us have different rhythms, which means different times that we feel more productive and more energetic, like I'm an evening person. Stress can lead to risky decisions. Try not to get stressed. It can cause you to have poor productivity or poor time management. And poor productivity or time management can cause you to what? Have stress. You have to find that balance, your balance. Divide and map your task according to your rhythm. Improve your high value task, which means getting your reports, payrolls, budgets, your move-ins, ARs, during the time that your rhythm is high. And your low value task, returning phone calls, checking emails, wait list management, during the time your values are low. Now, in order to not be stressed, you have to take a little break between the high times. Try to stay focused, however, but don't take a break away from the task. Just manage it better. Maybe you can get a cup of coffee in the office, tea, water, get up, exercise, walk around, but then return to the task. Now, attitude, the attitude that you reflect is important to you professionally and to your overall health for a number of reasons. Maintaining a good attitude can help support you towards achieving your goals. You may say, how? Well, first step is completing any project well. You want to complete the projects well. You want your work to speak for you. And in completing it well, you want to adopt a positive attitude about the work and the work that you're doing. However, maintaining a good attitude isn't always easy. You have to purposely work hard at keeping a good attitude. And one way to keep a good attitude is to keep a smile on your face. By checking off the items on your to-do list and realizing that you've accomplished the goals that you've set out, it should make you smile. You can see the accomplishments and you can show where your time has gone. It should brighten up your day and your attitude. With that being said, always talk through a smile. It makes all the difference in the world. There will be days when you don't feel so positive. On those days, take the time to think on the good things and reflect back on how far you've come and the difference that you've made in someone else's life. On the job that you have, you should make a difference not only in your life, but in another person's life also. Remember to stay positive. A positive attitude will take you to a different altitude. And with that being said, surround yourself with positive people that give positive feedback. Don't surround yourself with negative people because they'll only bring you down. As we embark on a new year, encourage yourself. Stay positive, think good things, stay on task, look at your to-do list, and keep a good attitude because the best of you is yet to come. We look forward to seeing you next Tuesday, and until we talk the next time, enjoy your holiday.